Hey guys, so today I want to do a quick little first look here uh, on the LG F60, which is a very, very coolish phone here. You can see there also a very, very cool phone here from um, LG that I bought today. I wanted to buy a phone. 1.2 GHz quad core, 5 million pixel camera, 2100 million battery. Uh, I think it's like, I saw a comment, like a Adreno 306 maybe. Um, yeah. But the coolest thing is that it, the software is kind of like an LG G3 uh, the phone is very very cheap uh, the display is not super bad, it feels very very robust. Uh, there's a very very bad thing about this phone and that is that you won't be able to install any super super big games like GTA San Andreas or not even GTA Y City. That's the, probably the biggest negative thing about this phone because it only has like um, one gigabyte. Uh, 1.3 gigabytes I think it is in storage and that's really really bad like you can see here available right now 712 megabytes and miscellaneous is like 2.3 gigabytes and I can't like delete those things probably most of the times maybe if you root the device and stuff like that but I don't think the major support from that right now because this is a new phone uh, so don't have it for gaming is uh, maybe you can insert an SD card, I haven't checked that, but the uh, Android Phone 12 4, not the latest version of Android, but very, very nice software here is my experience. You can also see here uh, how the tab experience looks like, pretty interesting. Not really bad, uh, is my first impressions there. Uh, also in here, I mean, very, very cool UI, I think. Very, very clean looking especially for a cheap device. Let's see here how the camera looks. If I can fire on this one maybe. So the first thing I can see here is that the camera UI seems to be pretty cool. It takes pictures very, very quick there. And it seems to be able to focus, which is nice that they are improving. So you can also take a look here, of course, at the pictures you take. And then zoom in and everything there, very, very smooth performance. Quickly go in and share. It looks like a pretty good camera also for family pixels. I mean, some are very, very horrible, uh, but this one seems to actually be having some quality in there. Um, so if you know any games that doesn't take up that much space, Definitely let me know if you want to see a gameplay here uh, on this device. So um, yeah, you can also see here quick toggles that you can use. A brightness slider here, of course. And uh, I have my mail here hooked up. Sweet. So just because it's not Android 5.0, uh, you can see that the UI is the old Play Store app here and uh, really would be cool if this device got Android 5 into Lollipop but I don't think so that kind of sucks though but uh, for low-end device I mean this software is really really good and it just feels really really nice in my hand like a baby like an LG G3 had a baby with like an iPhone or something really really cute phone I think so yeah, just a quick little first look video here, and as I said, if you want to know more about this phone, uh, let me know. You can also hear the, the sound, or lock sound and everything, very very cute as well. Um, yeah, I just enjoy this phone for some reason. Even though it's cheap, it's a cool phone. So um, yeah, quick look.